All right, Coach, you mentioned last week that it was going to take a few small miracles here and there to get into the NCAA tournament, and sure enough, you guys are qualifying and heading to Pittsburgh. Tell us some initial thoughts heading into the week. Yeah, last last Sunday we had an end-of-season team meeting. Uh, I told them that uh, there was next to no chance. I actually said that it was a zero chance that we'd make it out as a team to the national meet. So uh, to go from Sunday, having an end-of-season meeting, starting to prepare for track season, to Monday, getting a call from one of my buddies telling me that uh, our team had made it. Well, that was that was quite the turn of events, and I don't know if I felt that way. I don't know if I felt that kind of shock and excitement uh, in a while, and not just because we were going, but really because uh, we, we we didn't run on last Saturday in Denver like we deserved to be at the national meet. We we ran like we we deserved to be sitting in Canyon this weekend. So, but if you look the way we ran at the LSC meet, you look how we ran at Fort Hayes. We we deserve to be at that meet. Uh, we're, we're a team that can go out there and uh, belongs there. We have some boys there that are going to be up there and competitive and on the verge of being All-American, if not having one or two All-Americans in there. So we definitely are excited to get there, get a second chance, and uh, show that uh, our race in Denver wasn't wasn't who we really are. And so how do you use, I mean, obviously the motivation is going to be there, but how do you kind of translate that going into the week? Well, uh, really, uh, like I said, it's a kind of a second chance for some of our boys. We were very disappointed in our efforts. Uh, a couple of them were beating ourselves up. It was a very, I guess, depressing trip back from, from Denver. So uh, definitely the, the motivation was up. Like it wasn't just a, I, I don't think any of our boys had the feeling of, you know, we're just, we're just glad to be there. I think uh, everyone was like, you know what, well, now, now this is my time to really go out there and do what we're supposed to. It's going to be a little uh, crazy. It's looking like uh, snow. It was raining today in Pittsburgh. It's snowing the next two days. Thursday, it doesn't do anything. And then Friday, Saturday is rain, rain, rain. So I know the winning time was 34 minutes to the Atlantic Regional, which is compared to 30-30 at the, at the regional in Denver, which is at altitude. That just tells me it's going to be a mud fest. It's going to be tough. And, uh, you know, it really levels the playing field out there. But it also means that you got to go out there and be ready for it and be, uh, bring a little, a little bit more to the table. So... Uh, if we're going to go out there and be successful, we got to be ready to go out and run in some challenging elements that no one in the country, minus that region, had the chance to run in uh, this year. So uh, it's going to be it's going to be interesting out there, but we're we're ready, we're excited, and uh, we just want to go out there and come back with a top top 20. I hope top 15 finish. Uh, really surprise some people because right now we're not even ranked in the top 25. So I think that we're going to we're going to come back and uh, be pretty satisfied with our result. But that comes down to doing the work, which we didn't do uh, in Denver, but. I'll, I'll put my money on us that we're going to go out there and do what we need to do this time.